go! I saw it. No one believes me. But I believe you. What the hell? So I wanted to talk to you not only about your role as Alice in the movie, mm -hmm. but you played sort of the role within the role for the yes. movie that the boys were doing. Mm -hmm. So how difficult was that for you to be doing kind of both roles, and did you change it up as you went from the large picture into the smaller movie? Yeah, it's funny because my character Alice, she isn't an actress, you know, and um, so when she's playing Mrs. Hathaway, she sort of has to be a bad actress, you know, so you definitely have to change it up, and I think that... Uh, me and JJ talked about how Alice um, should play Mrs. Hathaway more like, you know, very adult, you know, mm -hmm. woman, how, you know, she looks at adults, so yeah. <laughs> we definitely had to change it up like that. And then as far as Alice goes, you know, you were kind of thrown in with the boys. Yeah. What was that like for you? Wow, it was, it was really fun. All of them were so funny and just so nice and um, we had the best time together and Alice when she comes into it she's like the tough girl you know she's very like strong she stole her dad's car and she's coming out there to you know drive all the guys to the train station um, and I just love that unique girl character I think that's great to have you know like a strong girl in the movie yeah absolutely and it really came across on screen when you saw you guys all like together and it was the funny parts it just seemed like it was really happening in real life yes. is that how it really was that's how it really was how it was on screen was exactly how it was off they were making like they were hilarious it's really easy to make me laugh anyway <laughs> so <laughs> I was laughing pretty much non-stop now, a lot of the scenes were pretty intense. How much of the stunt work did you guys have to do yourself and were you really in all the action for those scenes? Wow, well, um, a lot of it was green screen, so it wasn't actually happening. Like the train wasn't really, you know, flying over us. But, um, so when we saw the movie last night, we were like, that's not how it was. And so it was really neat to see it all put together. So working with the green screen, have you ever done that before? And what was it like to kind of have to kind of fake the big explosions and everything going yeah, on? Yeah, I've done it a little bit before, but not this big, because a lot of it was. And um, and JJ really helped all of us with that, say, letting us know what was gonna happen so we could dodge from whatever. You really have to use your imagination. Totally. And speaking of imagination, or maybe this is real for you, what do you think about extraterrestrials in real life? Do you wow. think they exist? Well, you know, it's hard to tell. They won't even know that we exist, you know? I mean, if they do exist. But, um, you know, seeing E.T. and Super 8, they make it so real that they really could actually, you know, yeah. come to our world. <laughs> so, um, who knows? Maybe in a million, you know, couple years, they'll be, they'll be here. <laughs> um, this movie has been very, like, shrouded in mystery. Nobody knows what it's about. You yeah. know, people are kind of buzzing on, on Facebook and Twitter and just saying, I have no idea what this movie's about, but I really want to see it. Yeah. So how important was that for you guys as the cast to kind of be very secretive when you were filming? And what do you think the payoff is going to be? Wow, well, I think that having a movie, you know, this secret, it really intrigues, you know, a lot of people. And, you know, seeing the trailer, he doesn't give that much away. and. For a while, all I could say was Super Aiden and J.J. Abrams, and now it's sort of unraveling, and people are starting to realize what it's actually about, more so. A little bit. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> and why do you think this is going to be like the summer blockbuster oh, this year? It's really for everyone, and I think that it's time for another movie to come out, like The Goonies and E.T., like for our generation. And um, so I think a lot of people are going to go see it. Hopefully they do. Definitely. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thanks. We have to find this thing. I don't feel good about this. Go! I saw it. No one believes me. I believe you.